Two months away. Two months? That's an eternity. Maybe for you. Do you know how hard it is to get a Manny and Petty? Hair and nails? This is the eighth grade semi, not your wedding. Aren't you snippy today? Did you skip out on the coffee? Coffee? I'm 13. You can't drink coffee that young. Says who? It stunts your growth. So I see Abby drinking a cup every day and she's like seven feet tall. Yes, yeah, so what? Jack also drinks coffee and he's barely five feet tall. Fine. Fine. Miss V, can you please make them quiet down up there? I'm trying to do my work. All set, RJ? I think so. Is everything okay? You seem a bit down today. Yeah, I think so. Again with I think so. Seriously, is there anything I can help you with? Not really. It's just that Sunday's only two months away and I still don't have a date. Well, two months is a long time. Kim Kardashian was only married for two months, and Cher married Greg Allman right after she divorced Sonny Bono. Who's Greg Allman? Um, who's Kim Kardashian? Touche. Well, what I'm saying, RJ, is that something is bound to come your way. Situations like this come together fast and furiously. That was a good movie. Uh, focus, RJ. Sorry, it's just that everyone thinks I'm the dumb kid who can't pass his math homework, or the poor kid who can't afford new shoes. I can't become Euclid overnight, and I can't be way too young to win the lottery. So I can't buy any shoes. Well, you have two months to change that, and we'll start that off by giving you some extra credit in math. You're giving me extra credit on a math test? Why? Because you know who Euclid is. Thanks, Mr. Thomas. <laughs> Semi, I could break a nail. Really, a nail? You know, nails grow back. Not these, they're beautiful. There's Butt Kisser Megan. I wish there was a way to shut her up. Look, she's good at basketball, too. I second that. If we wanted your opinion, we would have asked. Abby, be nice. I thought you and Megan were friends. We were, but she complained to Miss D about me using her account. Which I didn't. I simply hacked into her computer while she was using it. Hacked? Like literally? Like with a saw? How could you cut her computer in half? No, hacked. Like took control of her computer using the internet and I was able to use it while she was on it. Wow, that's cool. So you think there's a way to get her back for it? Summer, I just lost my 30 points in basketball. I'm not exactly right in the head right now. So you can't help us? Can't you do something computer related? Hack it again, but don't get caught. <laughs> you make it sound easy. It is easy, remember? You're on the geek squad. Well, let me think about that. Okay, I got it. Got what? A plan. Ooh, great, what is it? It'll cost you. Cost? Like what, 50 bucks? A hundred? I need a date to the semi. 
Whoa. What are you looking at? Tuxes for Semi. That doesn't look like a magazine that you'd be looking at tuxes in. Do you not see how high that guy is jumping? That's not even cool. Oh, jeez. If you were a boy, you'd think it's cool. I'm actually thinking about Semi and looking at pictures of dresses, hairstyles, makeup. It's just a magazine full of girls. There's no need to talk about what I'm looking at. I'm bored. And I'm busy. Did you take care of that thing? What thing? You know, that thing that takes place in two months? Oh, yeah, we're still working on it. That's too bad. I have this great plan ready to go. We'll take me then. <sighs> Please. How about Emma? Abby is a nice girl, and your friend. Besides, I need a partner for both the semi and basketball. So it's settled. Hi, Abby. Hi. Say, do you have a date for semi? Oh, I don't know. I have to type this right now. I know a boy who has the hots for you. Really? Yes, really, and he needs a date to semi. I mean, he wants to go with you. Who? Zach. What? Um, Abby, enough. But I wasn't screaming. Go to the office. <laughs> If any of you are looking for any last minute gift ideas for me, I have one. I want Megan, my classmate, brought right here the night of semi. And I want to tell her what a cheap, lying, no good, rotten, four flushing, low life, snake licking, dirt eating, inept, overstuffed, ignorant, blood sucking, dog kissing, brainless, hopeless, heartless, bug eyed, stiff legs, spotty lip, worm headed sack of monkey goo she is. Hallelujah! Holy cow, where is the Tylenol? Mr. Thomas. Are you calm now? Not really. I can't believe I got a detention for that. Speaking of which, have you thought about that? What? The date for semi? Who, Zach? You're crazy. But he's so nice and good with computers. You want me to go with someone to the semi just because they're good with computers? As if. But he found a way to get back at Megan. Do tell. Good job today, Zach. Nah. Yeah, how many attentions did you get for that? Let it go, Jacob. Let it go? You're the troublemaker here, not us. Yeah, you had to in your account. 
not the other way around. You're lucky the principal got you first and not us. Yeah, I would have kicked your butt. Is that right? Yeah, yeah. guys. I like writing shorts. I'm going to be an author. I'm going to be a novel. Yeah, dude. I'm going to walk in here. I'm taking it in Italy. Yeah, careful. Yeah, because you're too cute. I'm mean. Hey, Bonte, have any luck with seven yet? Not yet. Maybe we can find you a guy, uh, like Jacob, maybe, right? We can hook her up, right? Yeah, maybe I can ask him. Cool, thanks. You are not buying me flowers, no holding hands. We are not going out. I say when we can and can't dance. One photo and one slow dance, guarantee that. Group photo. There has to be at least two other couples in the shot. Deal. Can I get to work on your part? My part's already done. I just need yours, Emma's, and Summer's login name and password. I'll take care of the rest today after school. Here are emails. I'll give you the logins and password's name at the end of the day. Don't look at me. RJ, you seem to be in better spirits today. I think so. You finally getting the hang of this math? Yeah. RJ, I like math too, but something seems a little better than that. Some random person friended me on Facebook. And we've been talking the past few days. Random person? Am I going to be seeing you on, on Dateline, RJ? <laughs> no, a girl. And I think she likes me. Maybe I can ask her to send me. Wow, that'd be great. Um, how'd you meet her? Well, we both like pina coladas. No, uh, this is starting to get really weird. Hi, Zach. Hey, Abby. Please. Did you take care of that thing? Of course I did. Is the Pope Catholic? Yes. He is? I thought he was Polish. What? That's what Mr. Bigford said. Anyway, I took care of it. Tonight when you get home, there's a request on your Facebook for you to vote for this year's semi-formal king and queen. That's it? That's your big master plan? There must be more. I didn't sign up for this. When Jack and Megan go up there, They'll be in the perfect spot. You'll be able to do whatever you want. What we want? Yeah, when Megan's up there, you'll have her right where you want her. You can sabotage her moment. We could throw tomatoes at her. Oh no, no, eggs. Really? Eggs and tomatoes? We have to do something that no one will know it was us. Hey, where are you going? You have a date for seven. I know. Hey, uh, how tall are you? Five nine and a quarter. It's official. I have a date for the semi. Yay! You can't even be happy for me. I'm sorry. That is great news. Yeah, so will you. What about the boy you've been talking with on the internet? Shh. I don't want a lot of people to know about that. No, no about what? Everybody talks to boys on the internet. Yeah, but this one's different. He doesn't know it's me. Doesn't know it's you. My screen name is efrost98. Again, everybody uses fake names. White lies hurt no one. Wait, do white lies hurt people? What are you talking about? I don't know. How did you guys meet? Well, we both like the same things on Facebook, so I friend requested him. What do you both like? I 
I was tired of my lady We'd been together too long Like a worn out recording Of a favorite song So while she lay there sleeping I read the paper in bed And in the personal columns There was this letter I read If you like pina coladas And get caught in the rain If you're not into yoga I'm still unclear. Isn't the principal going to know the voting's rigged? And what if there's not enough votes for them to win? I know, Zach wasn't really clear about that. Hi, Abby. No pizza? Yeah, it's pizza day. No, I didn't have enough money to buy a slice. Hey, Abby, would you like a piece of pizza? Sure, thanks, Zach. I mean, thanks. Zach. How do we know that Principal is not going to find out the voting is rigged? What is this, amateur night? I have a bot running in the background that generates votes solely based on student enrollment. It will only calculate the number of students in the current class. It won't go up higher than that. How do you know how many students there are? Well, I hacked into the network computer that controls the student attendance sheet and found out how many students were at school on certain days, and the students were th that were there voted for Jack and Megan. You're so smart. Thank you, Abby. I guess the quickest way to win Abby's heart is by a piece of pizza. I gotta go. I think I'm just gonna go sit over there. I saw the post today. Congratulations on Simon King and Queen. No one can beat you now. I know, it's so wonderful. How does Jack like it? He's okay with it, I guess, but I'm really excited to wear my cat. I've actually been trying on like different crowns to see what it looks like on my head. <sighs> it's gonna be wonderful. Okay, yeah. I'm pretty excited too, but I'm pretty excited, so yeah, <laughs> see ya. All right, bye. Did you see that Megan and Jack are gonna win Summon King and Queen? Yeah. What's wrong? Oh, nothing. But I gotta get to class. See ya. Bye. Girls, good afternoon. Come on in. Have a seat. I have to admit, I'm really excited about the, the website that you made regarding the semi-formal and who should be the homecoming king and queen. Yes, uh, thank you. Looks like Megan and Jack are going to run away with it again. Yeah, it does appear to be that way. How did the two of you ever come up with this great idea? Well, my dad went to Boston College and he majored in computers. So he's really good at it and he showed me how to make a website. Yeah, and my cousin goes to Bishop Brady, and he takes computer classes, and that was a big help, too. Yeah, and the winner of the best site gets a trip on the Mount Washington this summer. Wow, that's great to have that kind of support at home. My mom's very giving. She's a school secretary, and she's always telling me to support and give back. Yeah, like the Salvation Army or Pennies for Patients. What do you guys want to do with your lives? I think I want to teach. I want to be an artist and have my work at the Museum of Fine Arts in Boston. Well, a teacher and an artist. That's great. Listen, I won't take up any more, more of your time. I'll let you guys get back to class. Thanks again, ladies. Is there something wrong with your ankle? I'm practicing for my beauty queen walk for when I win semi. Duh. Can you stay? Obviously. Okay, guys, I'm so excited for Semi. I got this blue dress and it's like really pretty. It's gorgeous. Where'd you get it? I made my mom go to the mall and buy it for me. Duh. <laughs> I have a date for Semi. Is it the one from online? Yes! What's his name? I don't know, he only uses a screen name, but he is so nice and funny. He sends me songs of what he plays on his guitar. Wait, wait, wait. You're going to summer with a complete stranger? No, we've been talking for weeks. Okay, 
But you don't know his name. And you've probably never met him, have you? But we both like the same things. I friend requested him. She's going to summit with a complete stranger? Like, seriously? We were just talking about my dress and how pretty it is, and she goes on about this tangent about this new boy, and a, she doesn't even know his name! Hey, don't forget to study for your math test. Oh, I will. Hey, Abby. Hey, Zach. How's it going? Did you enjoy your pizza the other day? Yes, I did. That was really nice of you. The plan is coming along smoothly. Megan is first in the votes. Yeah, Zach. Look, I gotta go. All right, I'll see you in computer class then. This play is working out better than I thought. I know, I can't believe the principal believed us. It's going to be priceless to see Megan up there like that. I haven't even thought about what we can do. Me either. Wait, I got it. We can put a bucket of water over the stage, so when Megan goes up to accept her crown, we can dump it on her. Hey, Abby. What, no lunch again? No. Maybe Zach will buy you lunch again. <laughs> What's the matter with you? That was funny. Wait, you're not exactly like Zach, now are you? This is the only supposed to be for the semi. Abby, he only bought you pizza. Remember how weird he is? Is he? What exactly is weird? Am I weird? My whole life, I have had to deal with being the tall girl or the ditzy blonde. Hey look, it's a jolly green giant. I never called you that. Not you, but people walk by and say, ho, 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 green giant. Remember the sixth grade dance when we had to throw our shoe in a pile and the boys picked our shoe to dance with us? Yeah, I remember that. I danced with... My shoe was picked last. You know, because I have a size 10 shoe. Wow, really? So yeah, Zach is nice to me, and maybe is not so weird. For once, someone has shown interest in me and not walked by and said, hey, how's the air out there? Oh my gosh, I never thought this would happen. And now here I am, planning to ruin Megan Semi, much like people have ruined my sixth grade dance. Since when do two wrongs make a right? Abby, she got you in trouble and a detention. She doesn't deserve to be up there. We need to put her in her place. Yeah, we're the good ones here, not her. It's time someone stuck up for us. What? No, Abby? <laughs> I'm gonna win semi queen and Jack's gonna be king. There's nothing bad about that. No, I'm not talking about that. I'm, I'm talking about what, like what's gonna happen on stage. Yeah, put a crown on my head. Okay, don't just rain on my parade. You're just jealous that I won queen and, well, maybe it's because you got braces. My braces are there to straighten my teeth and nothing else. What's your problem? Okay, first of all, I'm winning that crown and I'm going on stage to get it. There's nothing you can do about it. I don't care what you say, but this is my moment and I've been waiting for it all year.
I didn't know you played the guitar. <laughs> yeah. The black shirt, orange tie, that's you. Yep, a uh, red and white dress, right? Yep. How'd this ever happen? I have no clue. Shall we dance? Yes. If my words did glow With the gold of sunshine And my tunes were played On the heart of the sky. So, is this my only slow dance? My first slow dance or both? Let's just call it the first. Nice. Why'd you ask me to the semi deck? Why not? Well, you know, because I'm so tall and I loud and mean. Well, the tall thing I can't help you with, but I managed to figure out that you being mean and all is actually just an act. What, did you figure that out on your computer? No, Dr. Phil. You know, Zach, you're all right. So are you. Son, I don't know. Don't really care. So, when did you start to like pina coladas? Uh, I never really had one. I just like the song. Oh my gosh, liar. I had one when I went on my cruise this winter. That's cool. I want to go home. Yeah, they're fine. Oh yeah, my mom's poor. We don't get out much. Oh, okay. RJ, remember that time when we were younger and we rode bikes around the neighborhood? Yeah, that was before my parents got divorced. And I fell off my bike and broke my arm, and you helped me all the way home? Yeah. Why did you do that? Well, it's what friends do. You would have done the same for me, right? Of course. If I knew the way, I would take you home. La da 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 Again? Maybe if you didn't walk like Igor, you might have a chance at winning something. How can you say that? We're friends. I know, and friends take joy in uh, their other friends winning semi-queen. Why can't you be happy for me? I am happy, but I have a bad feeling about you going up on stage. I overheard people. People? What people? I'm not sure. I overheard it in the bathroom. People talking about me. I hope you know that when you're semi-queen, everyone talks about you everywhere. Why are you saying these things? Let's get this carnival started. I know, when are they gonna announce this king? Mm -hmm. Oh, I love this song. Ugh, this song is like a hundred years old. My grandfather used to play it up at the lake. So what, let's dance. For semi? And it comes as no surprise that it's Megan and Jack, so why don't you guys come up on stage now?
Well, my dad went to Boston College, and he majored in computers. So he's really good at it, and he showed me how to make a website. Yeah, and my cousin goes to Bishop Brady, and he takes computer classes, and that was a big help, too. Yeah, and the winner of the best site gets a trip on the Mount Washington this summer. I want to be an artist and have my work at the Museum of Fine Arts in Boston. My mom is very giving. She's a school secretary, and she's always telling me to support and give back. Yeah, like the Salvation Army or Pennies for Patients. Thank you. 